Well, God bless the state of Wyoming. Why am I saying God bless the state of Wyoming? Well, God bless the United States of America. Let me let me start with that because that's ultimately we need God's blessings upon the United States of America. Let's face it, guys, we do. But Wyoming, I'm giving them extra praise because the House there, the House of Representatives has passed a bill that will protect babies born alive from botched abortions. This is excellent news. This follows what took place over in West Virginia. They signed a similar piece of legislation into law as well. And which, by the way, West Virginia, let me just throw this out there, uh, is a state that just as a couple of days ago had absolutely zero cases of the My Sharona virus. Hmm, I wonder why that might be. Could there be possibly a link to those states who are looking to protect life uh, and those who are looking to not protect life? Well, I'll let you guys chew on that one. But um, Republican governor here, Mark Gordon, has yet to sign the bill. However, he is expected to do so. The bill, the Senate filed 97. It passed, get this vote, guys, 44 to 16. This thing passed, and um, it already had passed in the Senate, so it's already moving its way up the chamber here. And uh, the Republican governor, Mark Gordon, is expected to sign this bill. He is a pro-life governor. So just a matter of time, the bill has gone to his desk. He is going to sign this into law. And then Wyoming is going to join other states like West Virginia, who is going to protect the life of children. Now, guys, I got more on this really quick before you go any further. Do me a big, big favor. Give this video a like. Get the likes way up on this video, guys. Share the video here across all your platforms. Subscribe if you're brand new because you're going to love this channel. And guys, check back to this channel multiple times a day. Why? Because of the fact that YouTube is not going to give you all the alerts. If you don't want to miss anything, you have to keep coming back all the time because there's breaking news coming out all day long about the My Asia Runner. Restrictions here, restrictions there, restrictions everywhere. I don't know what to do. I, I Look at my hair. My hair is getting crazy. I can't even go get a haircut, guys, because the haircut places are closed. I'm going to have a huge afro before you know it. Okay, let me, let me, let me breathe. Let me breathe. Let me breathe. Let me breathe. Okay. Anyway, you guys get the idea. Help, help me out, okay? You can support the channel through Patreon for $5 a month. You know the deal. All the links in the description. So this is great news by Wyoming, like I said. But here's the real kicker. You know what the kicker is? Any physician who is not protecting the lives of these children, which basically states that if they're you know born alive through a botched abortion, they need to receive the same care, okay, that any other child would receive uh, through a normal childbirth, okay? And any doctor refusing to give that child the treatment that they need could face up to 14 years in prison. That's right, 14 years. And believe it or not, this, this struck me. There were some Democrats in Wyoming, in, in the House, that actually thought that the 14 years in prison was too harsh. Too harsh, get this thought it was too harsh for for those doctors that were willing to let a baby die. They thought that was too harsh. To me, they should go away in jail for longer than 14 years. That should be a life sentence. If you're taking a life, to me, 14 years isn't enough time in jail. You should put these suckers in there for life. That's just my opinion, though. But guys, this is excellent news. And like I said before, I've always said this. I'm going to continue to say it, especially what's going on right now with the My Sharona, all right? Any state that looks to protect life, I believe, will have the least amount of cases and that God is going to bestow a blessing upon those states. You watch for UA4. You, you could probably look at the numbers right now, okay? And I bet I'm pretty close to that, all right? I bet I'm pretty close to that. New York's not doing so good right now. California's not doing so good right now. Washington State's not doing so good right now. By the way, all those states have passed legislation uh, that look to enhance uh, basically unlimited access to abortion. Just saying. Guys, let me know your thoughts in the comment section. I'll be back with more. You guys take care. Please be safe out there. God bless each and every single one of you, and I'll talk with you soon.